Welcome back to Grandpa's time. Hey grandkids, this morning I'm going to talk to you about diesel engines a little bit. Now, let me turn this off. The question today is, uh, Grandpa, can I run used motor oil in my diesel pickup truck? And the answer is maybe. Uh, why would you, for one? But you could. Uh, some people do. If I had to, I wouldn't run it. I, I could probably run it in my old pickup. My, my, my pickup is 1993 Ford F-250. It's pre-power stroke. and it, So everything's mechanical. I could probably run it in this. And I'd probably start off at like 90 diesel, 10 use motor oil if I had to. And maybe work up to 80, 20, and maybe 60, 40. I mean, if the world came to an end and there wasn't any other fuel except for used motor oil, then I'd for sure try it. But uh, I have not tried it. I don't recommend trying it if you don't need to. But if diesel gets any more expensive, then I might try it. <laughs> okay. So, so the answer is maybe, but don't use it in a new pickup truck. Or newer, even anything even newer. Mine's pretty old, so I I feel safe maybe trying it in one tank. Uh, one of the major concerns is what it's going to do to your fuel injectors, and uh, maybe your maybe your uh, fuel filter too. So things to consider. But anyway, the answer is maybe. Then the other one is well, if I'm talking about fuel substitutes, can I use kerosene? Some people use kerosene, uh, especially when the temperature gets really cold. Uh, diesel fuel will gel up. It starts to gel or it starts to cloud up a little, even at below freezing Fahrenheit, like 32 and below. But it get, where it gets about 14, 15 degrees is where fuel will actually gel up and just turn, it'll look kind of like jelly. And so people will use kerosene because it, uh, it'll stay more as a fluid. At, at those lower temperatures but before you use kerosene they sell additives for it and if I don't have to I'm probably not going to use kerosene either so but you could use it and uh, you could mix it with your diesel and if you had to and maybe your fuel wouldn't gel up if you were in colder temperatures but if you can use a just the regular fuel that you're supposed to use and you can use an additive that they sell commercially then I'd probably use it first so I hope that helps and thanks for watching